welcome to a new video. In this video I go with you through the folders of the collection Spring Break and um, let's jump right directly into the um, CT um, layouts. My creative team was very um, busy and this is what they have created, especially some with the um, templates and here we have some really springy soft layouts they've created and um, here you can see the previews of the collection we have artsy bits we have page blenders we have the magic lights and um, page dividers two different packs of papers of course the templates we have the storybook templates and the um, weekly double page templates and of course some word arts so let's jump right directly into the folder and we have here the artsy bits and pieces um, very soft colors with this um, sunny yellow and we have pinks and a little bit of green and um, yes these are the artsy bits and pieces of the spring break collection the next folders are the art and shadow frames and you get two different um, packs one are the png files and then we have the psd files so they are layered let's open them quickly we have um we have the mask and then on top of it you have the, the frame and this frame you can um, change the colors by double click on the effects palette and change here the color of your choice for example. Um, you can add in a quick way your um, photos here by clicking on the mask layer and then only choose a, f um, a photo of your choice and clip that directly onto the onto the mask copy paste and i'm gonna click that now and need to make it a little bit smaller here that it fits better so uh, this is how one of the masks can look like maybe the frame now doesn't look pretty nice here something like that this is how you can use the the different mask of this collection we have here different sizes and um, this is the pack with the art and shadow frames and then we have the artsy page blenders they are all 12 by 12 um, inch so they fit perfectly together with maybe the solid papers only open one that you can see and maybe that one as well and then let's go back to the page um artsy page blenders and let's choose that one copy and paste and uh, where's the solid the yellow copy paste on top of it and we only clip the yellow paper now onto the page blender and uh, this is what you can get um, let's ch choose another one copy paste and we can add here the one and this is something different. You can combine everything together. You can use multiple page blenders um, to create your own um, paper. That's not at all a problem. So you get here in this pack four different 12 by 12 page blenders. They are transparent and black. And then we have the magic lights here. Um, yellow, pink, uh, white, and I like those those huge sunbeams here. They are awesome if you have any pictures. Um, let's 
directly choose that one um, close that one do I have that still open yes um, let's do that differently open as a new file nah Okay, here we go. So this is only the the image and look at it, what you can do. Just only add that and it looks like the sun goes up here. And um, if you change here the um, layer setting, you also can change here. Um, the way this uh, magic like look like on your page so you need to play around and um, every every image works differently with the magic light so it's always a little bit of try and error um, maybe and um, you get you need to to learn how to use them but um, it's a little bit of a playing and um, I think you get really cool effects with the magic light. So these are the magic lights here. You get bokehs, those sunbeams and um, yes, a lot of bokeh I see here. Um, also, I like that one, this glow and um, 20 different magic lights in this pack for you when you um, get this product. And then we have the next pack are the page dividers. Page dividers are also perfect if you, well, use that with a, with a solid paper. Open the green one and copy paste that here onto my end. Then we can um let's try another picture um maybe that rose and open as clipping mask so it clips directly now onto my and this is how it can look like um if you want to see it how it will look with a person just just well, show you no that one isn't good mm, oh this one is nice so pretty cool and you can see that it is now so you can also a little bit stretch um, this page blenders if you need that that isn't a problem and uh, doesn't change anything um, in the look you can also combine here different ones and maybe we can add here um, some magic lights uh, not magic artsy bits and pieces so I clip that one here and then we choose that one also we clip that one so totally different ways how to use such masks always think about that you not only need to clip um, pictures on a mask you also can clip magic lights you can clip um, papers you can clip whatever you like to um, and it's always be a little bit of a um, experimenting a new style or a new way how to use any um, my products okay so here we go we had now the magic lights we had the page dividers and you get the 
page dividers, they are all 12 by 12 um, width or high, so it depends on um, on the file, but um, they all fit on a 12 by 12 page perfectly. And you get six different page dividers here and um, they are all transparent and black. And then we have the next pack are the, um, the word arts. And the word arts um, you get here, where do we start? Um, we have here some um, colored ones. Maybe we use that one here. So, or we have um, some Dymo type ones. Uh, let's use that one here. Maybe over here. And then we have the cloud word arts. And they are special one. You get three different versions here. You get a black version. And this is how it looks. The black version. Then you have a colored one with um, different styles here. This is how it looks as a PNG file. And then the same um, colored one as a PSD file. So you have all words on a different layer and you can now start to design them by your own or you can move them around. You can add um, different styles from maybe um, new collections because this collection doesn't have a painter's toolbox, but um, you can do whatever you like to do with those layered files. Um, and this is how it can look like. So you can also clip here images. You can clip here artsy bits. Let's see what happens when we clip an artsy bit here. Um, Maybe that glitter sting thing here and copy and you see this is how it can look like when you only clip a artsy bit here. So it makes can make everything look differently for you. Okay, so these are the word arts and um, the um, cloud word arts and you get here four different ones in three different versions and then we jump into the papers we have to paint um i've painted them and i i this, this and i can remember um when i created them i was very um experimental with with textures and with uh, i used here a, a nice stamp I once bought and it really does have this great um, texture and thick paint on top of it. Here we have some little bit of tulle and a little bit of glitter and here's some nice texture of um, paint. It's like a little bit of peeled up. Then we have here paper and um, yes, you get nine different 12 by 12 paint. Um, papers here and then we have the solid papers so they are not re very solid some but some here do, does have a little bit of, um, of ornament here this is more um, textured and um, solid type of style and this one I really like that one this shimmery effect of this paper so you get here also nine different 12 by 12 solid papers. And let's jump right into the storybook um, um, templates. And you get, let's see, uh, this is, don't resolve. Each time when you open a template and it's white, don't be afraid, you only need to delete the uh, the first layer or you and you need to turn on your um, 
your layers by clicking on the first one on the top layer and then click hold and slide down and then everything is turned on so um, that's the way um, you can this is what happens here we have your PSD and we have here two files I don't know I need to check in those files didn't look into it properly before I started the video that's not good at all so ah uh, okay so ah uh, okay I split them up into into letter size but um, and then on the double page you get here the double page and um, so you, you can see that here so you have to, to split it it's really a letter size and a second letter size left and right page and you have here the double page so you can choose with whatever um, template you like to work if you like to work directly into uh, with the double page so you only need to open those ones and um, work with them just let me uh, <laughs> so this is also nice one the storybook are very clean and with um, some de little details here a little bit of watercolor but um, the masking for your um, photos are really clean. Um, I like to say that, yeah. So, and that's another page, double page here. And um, then we have here and here. Cancel. This is only the font you need to install or you choose another one you like to have. So this is the back page, back side, last page, however you like to call it. And that's also one. And um, they are so easily to use, very easy. So you go and click the mask and then you add only your... Oh the wrong one I want the uh, pixabay um, you only need to oh no so let's search for spring um, clip your images like this one and a little bit of a text and it's done and you don't need to do a lot and I think it's a really great way to to get um, a page fast or a, a whole photo book done in minutes with this um, template and it looks always clean and um, not too much um, overloaded I think so that was the intention when I started this series of storybook template so you see filling up that with um, photos is totally easy and doesn't take too much time let's where is this look at it okay so um, these are the storybook templates for this collection and let's jump into the weekly templates we have like um, always with the um, 2016 collections you have over always a month overview um, template and also here turn off the first layer and slide down all of the mask and this is how it can look like um, you see I also added here some some pictures and um, 
you you can add here really a lot of um, images a complete overview of the whole month you can create here with this um, template and this template with the overview is only available um, in the bundles so it doesn't it's not available as a as a single product so when you order something this is um, what you what you get okay so let's see I need to delete a lot of them so, okay so these are the spring break template overview and then we have here the week 14 also you get here a double page PSD file plus you get both pages split it into a 12 by 12 and uh, this is how they look like they are white when they when you order it and download it and it's white because with this kind of um, saving um, it reduces extremely the file size so when you when uh, when you download it the file size is uh, uh, way smaller than um, when I leave it this way um, that's the reason why it's always white but it's not a problem maybe you like to open it when you download it and um, change immediately the layers so you it's visible for you always um, in your folders so this is the week 14 and then we have the week 15 here a um, lot of grungy grunginess here and artsy and um, strokes and watercolor and a lot of ways to blend pictures into each other in the background and then you have here in the foreground your frames um, also here we in the week 16 also a lot um, or nice ways to blend your in the background your images you don't need to have those um, this paper here you can you can change that to the paper you like to have or you can um, um, use it um, with a photo like we do just just hold on this is the, and we use that one only just quick demonstration here and this is how you can blend in your background only an image or a photo whatever you like to and clip that done nothing more that's it so this was now the um, week 16 and then we have the week 17 here cancel also here you can get a lot of blending here with the watercolors here and overlaid a paint brush and um, also here the paper so yes a lot of things you can um, add here and blend and uh, I think it's very beautiful okay so this was a short um, unpacking videos of the spring break um, collection and um, I hope you enjoyed this video and um, if you like to join my autology group I would be happy or you want to subscribe to my youtube channel and um, also here I have in this little overview here all my social media um, channels if you like to join me somewhere maybe on Instagram maybe on Facebook wherever you like to okay so um, I think we're gonna see us in the next video and I hope you enjoyed it um, have a happy time
Bye. Bye.